In this example, we're going to apply a discount to a sale. There are three methods of discounting. You can specify an amount of, a percentage discount, or set a totally new price for a product. The important thing to remember about discounting is that it applies to a specific product or service. It doesn't apply to the order as a whole. We'll use Dave's dishwasher repairs for this sale. So let's make a sale. We'll go into our service fees and add our standard call out. And we'll also add an additional hours labour. Now let's review the basket. We're going to apply a discount to our standard call out fee. So we'll tap that, then tap options and change price. You'll see the three types of discounts. If we go into amount off, you'll see we could specify a dollar amount to deduct from this item's price. $15 for example. The second alternative is to apply a percentage discount. 20% for example. And the third option is to set an entirely new price for the item. Let's change our call out fee to $80. We'll tap update product. Now you'll see the discount is shown in red against the standard call out charge. We'll now go ahead and finish off this sale. Our customer is going to pay cash and we'll send a receipt. Let's have a look at the receipt. You'll see that the charge is $80 and underneath it show, it shows the original price of $100. So in summary, you can apply discounts at the individual product level by a dollar amount off, by a percentage off or by setting an entirely new price.